Yo, 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 and a ho, ho, ho. Welcome to BitRush Crypto's weekly NFT news. If you haven't already, make sure you do sub to the channel. If you're liking the video, smash a thumbs up on it. And let's get into this week's NFT news. If you haven't done so already, make sure you follow my brand, Abraxas Dow at Abraxas underscore Dow over on Twitter. We do have some cool stuff going. Right now we're minting the Chill Cubes NFTs. We have a claim for a comic book and we're about to release the winter version of the Pumpkin Patch game, which is still an open beta that is on iOS, Android, and you can play in your web browser. So come on over here to twitter.com forward slash Abraxas underscore Dow and you guys can get access to all of that. Now let's go ahead and get into the news. First up this week, we do have Amazon announces a new series, NFT Me, which explores NFT culture and its disruption worldwide. The capacity to digitally authenticate almost anything and the possibility of monetizing it in ways nobody could even imagine before. There are some of the ways that Amazon's new documentary series, NFT Me, introduces non-fungible tokens. The show features artists, collectors, and industry professionals across the world sharing their experiences with NFTs and how the merger between art and technology has positively affected their lives. So I have been looking for a new show to watch. Definitely going to go ahead and check this one out over on Amazon, NFT Me. I think this is the first show I've seen anyway about NFTs, so really cool to see spreading to the masses. And speaking of spreading to the masses, we do have MetaMask enables buying of Ethereum inside their app using PayPal. So we do have a uh, partnership here with PayPal and MetaMask, and it's now possible to buy ETH on MetaMask using PayPal thanks to a new integration. The feature allows users of the MetaMask mobile app to use the payment mode to buy the second largest cryptocurrency, Ethereum. However, as of now, only a select few in the United States have this privilege. The software wallet plans to slowly roll out the feature to the rest of the population in the next few weeks. So again, guys, this is absolutely huge. I'm um, talking about spreading to the masses. Um, PayPal does have like Ethereum based in their normal PayPal app. You can buy crypto and all of that, but you still need a crypto wallet to interact with, you know, DeFi apps or even NFTs or anything like that. They're going to need a real wallet to connect. And so this is great having a fiat on-ramp built into MetaMask, the most popular cryptocurrency wallet. It does seem like right now it's only for Ethereum, but I'm sure eventually they will roll out to some other cryptocurrencies as well. So really big news here. And we have Time Pieces partners with Deepak Chopra for spectacular NFT collection. So Time Pieces has partnered with the best-selling author Deepak Chopra for an all-new NFT collection, an exclusive set of limited edition artwork scheduled to arrive January 2023. Um, it says Time Pieces, the Web3 arm of Time Magazine, has partnered with the Seva Love Metaverse. Deepak Chopra co-founded the platform with the mission to promote well-being through the metaverse and beyond. Chopra found fame as a multi-best-selling author and world-renowned pioneer in integrative medicine. The collection with the commemorative Chopra best-selling book, The Seven Spiritual Laws of Success, reaching its 25th anniversary. So really cool here that we do see time um, partnering with Deepak Chopra. And I didn't know he had a metaverse, so that's pretty cool as well. Um, great to see people like this getting involved in crypto. Again, the more the merrier as it does spread, you know, to all kinds of different people that may normally not be involved in Web3 or NFTs. So I love seeing big celebrities get involved. And speaking of big celebrities getting involved, we do have Donald Trump Former U.S. President's NFT collection sells out, price surges. According to the data from OpenSea, the collection's floor was around 0.19 ETH or 230, more than double the original mint price. And just to let you guys know, I did check it out right before this article, and it's actually higher than that. It's around half an ETH right now, or a little bit under half an ETH, like 0.4 something. Um, so let's go ahead and get into the article here. We have former U.S. President Donald Trump's non fungible token digital trading card collectively sold out on Friday, the day after after its initial release. According to data from OpenSea, at the time of writing, the collection trading volume is 900 ETH, or about 108 million US dollars. Its floor price, like I said, it has gone up since then, but it was around 0.19, which is more than double the original $99 mint price. Some tokens are selling for much higher. The 101's the rarest NFTs, which comprise 2.4% of the 45,000 unit collection, 
roughly 1,000 are selling for as much as six Ethereum or even more. I think I saw one in there for over 20 ETH that sold. Um, one of these trading cards, the 45th president is standing in front of the Statue of Liberty holding a torch, is currently listed at 20 ETH or about $24,000. So again, guys, this is absolutely huge. You don't get much bigger than the US president in terms of like worldwide recognition. Obviously, Trump was already a celebrity before he became president, so that adds to it even more. Whether or not you like Trump doesn't really matter. The fact that this things selling out and it's going to all kinds of people that normally wouldn't buy nfts probably don't even still know what nfts are as he didn't use the word nft in his collection at all he labeled it as a digital trading card this is absolutely massive for the industry so we are definitely set for big growth from here guys i've been saying every single week or at least every week that i do the news we're only getting bigger and bigger and bigger i say less than five years and everything on the web will run on web 3.0 as it is a better system and nfts do backbone that system so great to see see all kinds of different collections um, authors like Deepak Chopra Amazon starting to cover it with a documentary and PayPal integrating with MetaMask all these are great features and great things moving forward the ball for the NFT marketplaces for web3 as a whole for blockchain technology it's only a matter of time so Merry Christmas Happy Hanukkah Happy New Year whatever you celebrate hope you guys are having a great holiday season as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, I am minting my winter collection of NFTs, the Chill Cubes, which does tie into my comic book series and my game. If you guys want one of those, go ahead and drop your Ethereum address in the comments below. I'm going to pick some winners and drop a whole bunch of NFTs, so make sure you guys drop your ETH address there if you want a free Chill Cubes NFT. And again, happy holidays. Make sure you sub to the channel, bell on to be notified, pound on that thumbs up button. Woo! -woo!